So yeah, it's been a little while just because I realized how kind of ridiculous it is to try to do one of these every single day because it's really just the same thing. I'm just working, trading hard, making sure I'm getting everything done. Man, my hand is huge. Okay. Um, so yeah, just update as of last week. Uh, my toe is great. I have not been having any problems. I still wrap it just because if someone directly decides to kick it, then I kind of curl up in a little ball and die a little bit for a couple minutes, and then it's okay. Um, let's see. I just got a Nutra Bullet, which I love. It's awesome, which is great because I have. I need, do need to drop a couple more pounds in the next two weeks before I compete. And I think that'll really help go a long way towards helping with that. So that means no, no pizza. No pizza for the next two weeks. So sad. But I just bought a bunch of stuff and I made up like, I've been just throwing up random things in the Nutribullet and seeing how it turns out. Uh, basically, if it doesn't taste great, I just add peanut butter and blend it again and peanut butter makes everything better. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, just been training hard. I had a lesson with my coach today, and he basically has said that, um, well, because we're now sending three of us blue belts to Worlds. There's myself, Andrew, and Kenny, and I'm doing lightweight, Kenny's, Kenny is doing heavy, and Andrew's doing middleweight, and I, Sean basically has said that he believes all of us can win. It's just a question of will we. Because, and, you know, as everything starts getting closer and closer towards the, in the eliminatory matches, it really comes down to just the little tiny things um, that you, like, miss that, or you just aren't, don't push through at this point where you need to. Or, uh, so, it's, so yeah, it, the ability is there. It's just a matter of the little stuff. Make sure that little stuff is just right. Um, I'm not really learning anything new at, at all at this point. It's just drilling stuff over and over again. Coach has really been working on me with uh, yeah, re getting my full getting my full open guard back when someone like is trying to smash my knee shield down, which is a problem I've had in the past. He got me going with this really awesome uh, move that is great, even when he is putting all of his. 200 plus pounds on my leg, I'm still able to get it out and get back to my full open guard, which Sean says he's never seen me lose from my open guard. Um, I, it's, it, I just get a problem when I might, again, get someone smashes my knee down and I'll maybe lose by an advantage. But so the key is to keep that guard there. I love the new rules. Um, there's a video out with one of the referees explaining the rule changes, which was very, very useful since trying to read the rules on the knee reaps and such, my brain was just like, it just, but when the referee explained it, it was just like, oh, that makes sense and I like it. It's a very good, they did some very, very excellent changes for the rules. We'll see a lot less stalling and won't have that huge rush of DQs for the accidental knee reaps. Um, but that's about it for today.